Hello and welcome to Polymer Update. This is Simran Chaudhary and you're watching Polymer Update TV, the only TV in the world with the daily Petra Kamekas news show. Our special news reel today is sponsored by Jalgao based Hira Rotor Compounds, a manufacturer of rotor molding powder, rotor foam compounds, and one shot foaming. The company invites all to visit their stall number M09, hall number 4, at IPLEX 18 International Plastic Industrial Exhibition from August 3rd to August 6th at High Tech Exhibition Centre, Hyderabad. Let's start with the energy news. Crude oil prices on Friday evening at 6 p.m. Indian Standard Time were assessed lower. WTI traded at $68.76, a fall of 20 cents per barrel, while Brent was at $73.41, a fall of 4 cents per barrel. Prices fell on the back of mounting tensions between the US and China and concerns over a slowdown in Chinese economic growth. Open spec NAFTA prices on Friday, meanwhile, were at the 667 US dollars per metric ton CFR Far East Asia levels, a day on day gain of 5 US dollars per metric ton. Let's take a look at the closing future market on China Dalian Commodity Exchange for today, on August 3rd, 2018. LLTPE prices are higher by 65 RMB per metric ton from the previous settlement at 9535 RMB per metric ton. PP rates are up by 198 RMB per metric ton from the previous settlement at 9702 RMB per metric ton. PVC prices are higher by 140 RMB per metric ton from the previous settlement at 7040 RMB per metric ton. Moving on to Chinese and Indian currency updates. A record string of weekly losses saw China's yuan closing in on the key milestone of 7 per dollar on Friday, a level it hasn't weakened past in more than 10 years. The currency tumbled as low as 6.8965 per dollar before suddenly pairing before the official close when traders said they saw at least one large bank aggressively selling dollars. The Indian rupee on Friday closed higher against the US dollar after local equity markets surged over 1%. The rupee ended at 68.62 a dollar, up 0.14% from its previous close of 68.71. The currency opened at 68.68 a dollar. In polypropylene market, Polypropylene prices slipped in Asia. Prices fell as the buying pulse continued to remain lackluster in the region. The prices drop was further pressured down owing to lower import offers from the overseas suppliers. In polyethylene market, polyethylene prices down adjusted this week in Asia. Prices fell as regional buying remained extremely dull. Sellers struggling to transact were forced to drop their offer prices. Reports of ample regional product availability further supported the price drop. In ABS market, ABS prices firmed across the Asian region this week. Prices gained mainly on account of firmer upstream cost, coupled with improved regional demand trends. That's all for this week's Polymer News. Watch our daily news video from Monday to know more. It's Friday, August 3rd. This is Simran Chaudhary. Thank you. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash polymerupdate and be sure to click the like button. You can also find us on Twitter at polymerupdate. For the latest news from the plastics and petrochemicals industry, subscribe to our YouTube channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon.